Good morning, and by morning I mean afternoon. This is like 10 after 2. Um, I'm breakfast drink, just made my bed. I have a huge list of things that I would love to get done before stream, but they're all kind of superseded because I have to check something first. Last night I happened to go to my Twitch page and I was like, 2.8k followers. Like, that's weird because I like still haven't hit 2.7 and I got follow bought it while I was off stream. So I'm like, well, I'm just going to ignore this for now, but we're going to check to see if, because like Twitch has bots and stuff that do things and so I'm hoping shoot it's still 2.8 so that means I have to go through and ban ban like a hundred people so that kind of supersedes everything and by people I mean bot so this is this is it here wow it just keeps going it just keeps going just keeps going might be more no that's it's a hundred because I know what I was at before. So yeah, that's fun. Nothing like superseding everything else I plan to do today. I could probably edit something while I ban, 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 ban. It's just it's gonna be annoying. Okay, so in good news, it looks like Seribot did ban. Maybe not all of them. I didn't check all hundred and two of them, but Seribot banned the large majority. I remember when I got followed about it on stream out of like two hundred bots it got all but 13 so like I'm not too concerned about it however my numbers are still grossly inflated so I turned off my um I turned off my follower goal and stuff because like that's gonna drop by like 102 bots at some point here 102 lies um so that's where we're at um also totally unrelated but last night or yesterday there was a new fall guys update and this new season is so bad, I don't think I can play Fall Guys anymore. Like, it is just so bad. Not enjoyable at all. But anyways, I can get rid of the follow bots off my list and start working about, about, start working on other things and then finally get to this now that I'm like, you know. <laughs> okay, I folded all my clothes and I've put everything away but the stuff I need to hang, which is typical of me. Um, so we're slowly getting through. I'm thinking I'm gonna work on pulling clips now. It's like quarter to three. So I have until like four, I'll probably start getting ready at four. So I get like an hour and a bit to get stuff done. Oh my goodness. I don't think I mentioned this. Oh, we created a new redeem on my channel, which includes me trying to draw things. I can't draw very well. It's much rev. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to remember to put some pictures up on screen of some of the other things we drew. People really enjoyed it. So I ordered um, more index cards because we start with sticky notes and we upgrade to index cards. So we ordered more index cards that, um, are not lined on the back, and um, a couple more felt as well. I also got myself a scanner um, so I can scan things in more readily. So we are committed to this cause. Not me just sitting in a dark room. <laughs> well, I mean, it's kind of dark. I don't have the lights on. Um, it is just six o'clock. I just finished dinner. I got so much done in terms of clipping. I'm so excited. Um, so typically what I've been doing when I've been clipping is I've been just going back to the back and just like trying to catch up and recently what I did is I started going from both sides so from the most recent ones and the oldest ones to meet in the middle I only have five VODs left with clips which is very exciting and what I've been trying to do too is like every after every stream or after every two streams I'm trying to go back and clip the most recent VODs and so that's been so helpful I still have like over 300 clips I need to convert for vertical format and um, however many I still need to download. Excuse me. But we are getting there. I'm just gonna listen to some music I think, cut my, get my lips stain on um, and start to think about what I'm, gonna, what I'm gonna wear for stream. It's um, Echoes of the Plum Grove. We should be getting married tonight in game so that's exciting faster than in real life. Government stuff. Um, but it's fine. Um, but yeah, that's that is the current update. Alrighty, so there's this bot called Commander Root, Command Root, something like that, that I knew had something to do with bots, and it's actually one that you can give it access to your channel, and then you can see your whole follower list, delete the whole thing if you want to, which is obviously not what I want to, but there's actually filters, so because I get an email when one follow comes in, like say I'm streaming, if one person follows, I won't get one for every single person, but when the first person follows, I'll get that email. So I got that email when the first bot followed, so I was able to pinpoint the time, mostly between like 2 and 3 a.m. 
and just mass delete. 40 of the bots were already known bots, and then I think I had like 60 some odd to delete on my own. So that's exciting. I hope um, I didn't accidentally delete anybody else, um, but they shouldn't have appeared in that filter, hopefully. Anyways, that's where we're at. I'm just about to get ready for stream. Obviously, this light is not working. <laughs> It does its own thing. Um, I think I'm just gonna wear this top. Normally I don't wear like tanks, um, but I'm very comfy and I don't feel like changing, so. Well, hello, we are in the post stream time. It is 2.20. I'm listening to um, Morgan St. John, um, who I just found today. She's got like some really good like rage, feminist rage stuff like kind of along the vibes of uh, labor and I'm really enjoying them. I just, I picked up two of her EPs today and it was good. But anyways, like I said, we are in post stream time. I just had to run up the stairs to get the camera and back down. <laughs> I'm so ashamed. Um, so I'm making myself some chicken nuggets and fries because honestly, the circadian rhythm is off. The eating time is off. Um, <laughs> but I love this, it's the ninja. I think it's like dual, dual. I saw it's in a flyer. <laughs> What's it called exactly? It's the Ninja Foodie Dual Zone. I knew the word dual was in there. And I love it because I've got it set right now to smart finish. And so that means I set up the temperatures and the times for both of them. And as soon as it hits the time for this side to start, it's gonna start. It is lovely. <laughs> I recommend it. They apparently have a new one that's like up and down, which I'm intrigued by. Space Saver. <laughs> Why am I talking about an air fryer? Very passionate about air frying with food. <laughs> Anyways, um, I should have food by like 20 to 3, and then I will eat. So I'll finish for like at 3, take off my makeup. I went in and hung out in Wesley's chat for a bit because he's streaming. He has like, he must have got a big raid or something. I look forward to hearing from him because he has like 125 viewers, which is so amazing. Um, but yeah, it's um, it was a really good stream. I got married, I had a baby, oh my god. The speed, the speed in this game, I mean I understand it because you could die at any point from disease or whatever, but the speed in this game, Echoes of the Plum Grove, it was like, I, may, I gave the guy flowers to say I was interested in marrying him. And so he said, okay, you need to become friends with my brother. I did that. So I went back to him and he's like, okay, let's have a date tomorrow. So we went on that date and then on that date, I had the option to propose and I happened to have an engagement ring because I had been like planning it. Um, and so I proposed, he's like, okay, our wedding's gonna be tomorrow. And then that night after our wedding, he was like, do you wanna have a baby? I was like, okay. And then um, I was pregnant the next day. I think I was pregnant for like two or three days and then there was a baby, I had a baby for two days and now I have like a school aged child. <laughs> I mean, I get it. Cause it'd be weird if it like didn't go that fast. <laughs> Cause like, yeah, anyways, it's been wild. And then my child got smallpox or chicken pox or something. And then my husband did too, but I'm inoculated. Cause I was thinking that through, but yeah, no, it's been, um, it's been good. I really enjoyed the game. I'm excited though to get back into Stardew Valley, which is what we're going to do on Sunday because I'm not playing Fall Guys now. Um, so I think it'll be good, but yeah, it was good. Oh, and then we ended the stream with, I was going through like my stream journal cause I've been keeping it since January of 2022. And so it was like so nice to just like, walk down memory lane and, and stuff and be, and be like me being like so excited like guys I got 60 followers <laughs> and like now we're closing in on 2700 which is insane um but yeah anyways okay I'm gonna shut up and listen to music and just de-stream a bit this was more fries than anticipated I've been watching this journey it's uh who is it Jenna Phipps she is renovating a home in North Vancouver, which is kind of cool. So I have been watching, I think this is episode 14. They're like, just got like all the electrical out. Um, eventually they have to get the roof off and repaired, but there's like a pool in the back. It's so cool. Okay, time to eat. A ferret-ish <laughs> in a Sherlock Holmes hat is one of the things somebody asked me to draw. I kind of, like, I miss kind of like the last stream where people would just be like, just draw a giraffe. Now people are like being very specific and I'm like, <sighs> anyways, I've taken off my makeup. As you can see, I all of a sudden am in just gassed. Um, it's 3.30, so I just need to, I didn't hang up my clothes 
but I'm just gonna drop them on my bed, put all the paper stuff on my desk, and get, find my pajamas, and we're out cold. So, with that, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing, fantastic, wonderful <coughs> existence, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!